This is Bubba's 3D printing, and we're going to be going over the the dual extruder that I bought. Uh, comes in a uh, Mylar package, and it has a clear front. Uh, it says 3D dual gear extruder filament dual gear, made in China. <laughs> it's uh, made of metal. Seems like it's made pretty well, even though it came from China. And uh, we'll be able to adjust this and control the tension uh, going uh, pushing the filament to our extruder uh, I think this is a really good purchase for the Sunlu S8 uh, I'm going to show you how to put this together we're going to lay it out on the table and I'll show you what all is in the package alright so the first video didn't go well so I ended up making another one on uh, taking off the extruder uh, so the first thing that you'd do is you would remove move the gear the gear is right here you remove that uh, it's got uh, two little teeny tiny hexagon 1.5 millimeter uh, screws in it you just loosen them up and you push down on the tensioner lever and take it off uh, you then you don't have to take off this uh, the actual little roller for the tensioner that's actually as you can see it's only on the lever itself uh, you just have to take off this screw right here that screw that goes right in here so you just take that off and uh, you take off the spring after you take off the spring you then you can take off the housing and t housing's got two two bolts right uh, right here uh, they're all two millimeter and a little flat head up here at the top and the other one's just going to go on just the same uh, so all right so we've installed the housing for the extruder uh, which is the red one that looks like this then we put on the gear and the gear lines up with the filament hole uh, we we put the two the two non uh, flat screws on the back side and then we're going to take the the bigger 2.5 the bigger 2.5 millimeter uh, hex head screw and we're going to put it on the back side of the extruder housing it gets, it's going to go back here on the back side just going to screw it in about halfway then we're going to take the spring stick the spring on and then we're going to take this small two millimeter screw is going to go into the uh, tensioner lever. You're going to take that and you're going to stick it uh, inside the spring. After you got inside the spring, you're going to take the this friction uh, housing for a your long 2 2.5 millimeter hexagon screw and you're going to stick it inside that housing then you're going to take the housing and the screw and you're going to stick it inside the tensioner lever you're going to take your 2.5 millimeter hex head And you have to put a little pressure on the, the tensioner lever to get it lined up. There you go. We just installed our new uh, dual gear extruder.
All right, I forgot to put on the fitting for the uh, filament hose. So I'm just gonna stick it on real quick. Of course you knew that. Uh, and we're going to be coming up on the deleted scenes and I hope you think it's funny and you laugh and we have a little bit of fun. Uh, we've been taking it serious so far. Uh, so stay tuned to the deleted scenes. I'm just gonna stick this on real quick with the 10.5 millimeter wrench. Sure, it's pushed all the way up in there. Pull back a little bit. And there you go. Now she's done. Here comes the deleted scenes. Bubba's 3D printing. We're going to put this together and we are going to show you how to put a dual extruder on your son Louis 8. Woo! <laughs> Big Bubba's 3D printing. We come to you to put the extruder together. And when we put this extruder together, the Sun Louis S8 will fucking fly. <laughs> Bubba's 3D printing be gonna put together. Mm -mm. Dual extruder on this Sun Louis S8. And we're gonna make sure, got good tension. Good tension. Very good tension. Going to the hot end from the filament. Oh, the filament. <laughs> Dill extruder, Sun Louis 8. My foot, your ass. Done. Done. So I hope you liked the video. Uh, if you would, subscribe. Uh, I need a thousand subscribers to be monetized uh, so I'm gonna be putting this this video on several different platforms and uh, hopefully I'll get the subscribers I need to become monetized uh, so hit thumbs up if you liked the video thumbs down if it wasn't helpful uh, and subscribe Big Bubba's 3D printing